There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. What's up, Divas? And what's up, Divas? So it's your girl, April, and I figured since um, I just finished doing some wig videos, um, I don't even want to talk about it because those was like a real miss. Um, they were $8 wigs from like one of the international websites. It was three of them. Listen, when y'all see the video, y'all gonna have some good laughs. But anyway, so I got a wig from Missouri. Zuri, okay, and this wig is actually cute. This is their sister brand, Sis Sister Wig, and this wig is the Diva Pre Tweezed Part. Now, I think this is a really cute wig. I like it a lot. Um, it's a really nice wig. It reminds me of those that I have already worn, like Montessa, um, Blue Meadow, um, Fulami. Uh, either way, um, it reminds me a lot of that. So, but the only thing that it doesn't remind me of is the color. So when Zuri sent this wig out, I'm not really sure if they sent everybody the same color. I'm pretty sure they didn't. But why did they send me the color fuchsia? Did they think that this went well with my complexion? Like seriously? Like it's real cute and all. The style is like bomb bomb.com but did they think that the pink fuchsia went well with my complexion because i don't really do this color wigs at all but we just gonna do this for today okay now normally what i will do is i will take a dark marker not excuse me um mascara and i will make the wig roots dark because i don't like my roots to be this color i don't do that okay but you know what for today's sake i'm gonna just leave it like it is I'm going to just leave it like that because that's just what I'm going to do for today. But what's cool about it is it's a pre-tweezed part. So y'all see that right there? Pre-tweezed. Y'all probably really can't see it, but it's right there. It does have the combs in it and it does have the adjustable strap. But the color is just like way, way, way off. Um, like fuchsia is not for me. The texture though is really nice. I love the texture of this wig because it is like that light, that yakky texture. The texture is bomb. And I'm not even going to front. The color is really, really pretty. Like the color of the wig is so pretty. But for me, I would need it to be... I would wear this. I would so wear this. But the roots have to be dark. Okay, so... I, I can just go and darken the roots myself of the unit with no problem, like, not a problem. But first, we're going to see how it looks without me having to do all of that. But the first thing I'm going to do, because you guys know, I'm going to put on my um, black opal uh, foundation stick, the color Kalahari Sand. I'm going to put that on it first. And it's the exact color of my face. Um, I stopped, well, I decided to use something different opposed to my e.l.f. Because I just wanted to try something different. Okay, and did I forget to mention that the wig is called Diva? Yes, Diva. Okay, only divas wear fuchsia. And I'll drink to that.
Okay, you know what? Um, I'm sorry, but I'm liking this freaking wig. Like, for real, I don't never do no colors like this. Why is this wig so big on me? Oh, my. Okay, hold on. Okay, this wig is actually really cute. Diva is diva, but the color is really a cute... It's a cute color, for real. Like, I'm really liking this color. And listen... All you got to do, you may, I, I ain't even got to make the roots dark, even though it's dark right here. People don't really be paying attention like that. I wish somebody would say something to me like, hey, why your roots up here is dark? I'd be like, what? Excuse you? Hmm. People don't even be paying attention, but I like this. Like, it's style really, really cute. And listen, you guys already know how I do with the freaking hair. When it's too hot, I take it and I will surely pull out some hair in the front. And have this sitting right up on the top like, oh yeah, I got pink hair and I'm still cute, okay? This is, I, I like this wig. I do like it. I'm not even going to front. I like this. I do like this, okay? So it's really, really cute. Um, but like I was saying, they start looking all alike. Like, I don't really care about the color. If it was in a darker color, it would look just like the last wig that I just did a video on or the wig before that. But this one is absolutely cute. Like, it's pink, it's fuchsia, and I look cutesy in it, and I'm gonna rock this. Like, don't be surprised if y'all see me in a video and you be like, oh, Diva got her pink hair on. Be like, yes, what's up? Okay, what's up? Mm. It's cute though. It's really cute. The texture is really, really nice. The style is gorgeous. I like this one. Um, it's hot though. I'm gonna tell y'all that. But let me just put some of this to the back. It is a nice size cap. Like for real. If you got a nice size head or you got a lot of hair, then Diva will work. But it's a nice wide part like already done for you and that's what i like about this one a lot like this okay zuri come through come through zuri like what yes and look how it like melts into my skin yes really cute i think i'm about to take a selfie or a few selfies either way so this is so cute i love the brightness of it and the way you see it is exactly the way it looks it is a fuchsia color so pretty and just like a gorgeous pink this is like really pink pink is one of my favorite colors so i love like this I was talking all that mess about the color you know because it was really different like okay it was just different for me okay I probably would have never chose this color but I'm glad they sent it to me because they done pushed me outside the damn box into the road and stuff okay but yeah so check out Zuri sis this is the diva pre-tweezed wide part I'll place the information below of where you can pick this unit up at but this is super cute so for those of you who want to venture out into wig world Go ahead with this one. I'm telling you guys. The texture is so realistic and it's just so full. And you could just do many things with it. Um, you don't have to get this color, but this is fuchsia. And I don't know if I want to darken the roots. I don't even think I'm going to. I think I'm going to just leave them like that and wear this just like this. And that's that. So on that note, let me know what you think. Um, stay diva and divolicious. Make sure you rate, comment, and subscribe. And I will hit you guys up on my next video. Enjoy your night, and I love you all. And um, yeah, see you guys soon.